What's up guys? It's me Zamani again. Um, I'm just doing a really, really random co-wash video because look at this shit. Look at this. It looks a mess and needs to be moisturized. So I'm just bringing you guys along for the journey, showing the tripod and everything. So yeah, um, you should be co-washing your hair like, I don't know, at least once a month if you want to have moisturized natural hair because it's looking like shit right now. And we're getting ready for that. Okay? Stay tuned. What's up, guys? I'm back with another video. I had to, you know, cut the music off because apparently we get copyrighted even when you have no subscribers. We're co washing with Coconut Curls, like Organics brand, I think. You know, I'm listening to my bitch Cuban doll, so I am getting lit in this video. Rinse, rinse, rinse. What you should always do before you put conditioner in your hair or shampoo or whatever else you do in the shower. <laughs> As I am still getting lit. Not putting, oh, here we are. Getting that conditioner, getting that dime sized <laughs> amount of conditioner. Mm hmm. And we're putting it on in three, two. Oh, yeah. Get in there. Yep. Just get the front. That's what we do, Zamani. That's what we do. Oh, we're getting more dime size. Okay, conditioner on the back. But we're getting more dime size. And we're putting it on the back. You know, you might gotta make sure you get all of those strands. Even though I've watched this a couple times. So obviously I saw that. I've missed some strands. Which were really on the sides. But once you rinse it out, it'll get to all the strands. So don't really worry, but try to get all the strands. And a way for me to attempt to get all the strands is to use a Denman brush. Yes, Denman, it. Yep, just go front to back. And then that Denman brush distributes all the product through your hair. When I have longer hair, like when I used to have longer hair, I used to use a wide tooth comb. And I used to have this debate with these two girls in my Godspell cast, and they would always be like, no wide tooth comb. And I'm like, you know what? Honestly, they're right. Denman brush is the best. Like, I could have kept Denman brushing in this video for another five minutes because it feels so amazing. But now I'm going to wash my face and my body and whatever, and then let the conditioner sit. And now that I've done all that, I rinse it out. Oh yeah, rinse it all out. Just look at that beautiful hair. It just instantly looks more moisturized. And I'm singing Broken Clocks now because who the heck does not sing that with their heart? And me showing you what you should get. Organics, coconut curls, conditioner. Get it or be <laughs> So we are done co-washing. Uh, once you wet your hair, rinse your hair, wash your hair, co-wash your hair, put it in a cotton t-shirt because a towel will rip your hair apart, okay? And a cotton t-shirt will not, and then your hair will come out looking beautiful and grow beautifully, okay? Keep it in mind, don't fuck it up. Um, I'm actually gonna show you guys this little routine. I been using this for like two years in my life my skin looks great i haven't had it for like a couple months maybe five months but i'm using it now to show you guys the results because this is well deserved in your life so first you will squirt the mask onto your fingers this is after a clean face in the shower and you will put it on like a regular mask like a regular clay, mud, peel off mask. Now, with that, I normally use a paintbrush, but with this, you just gotta use your hands because it just is way easier. And the bees will get stuck inside of the paintbrush. We don't got time for that, right? Right, ladies and gentlemen? Exactly. Yeah. 
real quick. I think my cousin found out about me in a way that I'm not going to explain. But he put on his Snapchat something pretty subliminal and I definitely thought it was about me. Who knows if it was, who knows if it wasn't. He's been posting lately, so it probably was not about me, but I think it is. More. But yeah, you spread around like so all over your face. Don't miss a spot. This isn't a pull off mask, so you don't need to be scared of facial hair or eyebrow hair being pulled off. And then you keep the mask on for 10 minutes, maybe more if you want. Actually, no, 10 minutes. And I love exfoliating my lips, so I'll put it on my lips. Mmm. <laughs> so good. But yeah, face for 10 minutes. And then wait. So I'll see you guys when I'm gonna rinse my face. And rinse my face and rinse and do whatever to my hair. See ya. All right guys, it has been on for 10 minutes now. Time to rinse. You know, if you wanna see the skincare routine, check the previous video, wink, wink. Um, and yeah, and then you'll get to see what I do with my hair after I co-wash or wash my hair. I'll be back. Oh yeah, rinse it cold water. Not warm. Never warm. I'm kidding, you can do warm sometimes, but for this mask now I can do cold water. Or some other mask too. Cold water. But if you're just washing your face, use warm water. Don't kill yourself. I'll be back. I'm back with a clean face. Now time for the skincare routine. I'll show you the products, but I'm not gonna show you because I have a previous video to watch for you. Go watch. But one, two, take your pictures, screenshots, three, and four. Well, actually, five. See you in a sec with my hair. Hey guys, I'm back with a clear face. You know, you know how I got this clear face. Cause you watched the last video exactly. Give yourself a hand. So yeah, on to the hair. My hair is co-washed as I just said 5,000 times. And what I do, I just put oil in my hair because it like separates my strands some way that I just really enjoy. And these two oils saved my life, saved my hair. You most likely have one of these in your home. But the first oil is extra virgin olive oil. Yes, I know, right? People who are not aware of natural hair, oil is the best for your natural hair. So, this is the first one. Into the whole hand, as much as you want, as much as hair as you got, is what I mean. Because obviously, if you want to do as much as you want and you just do too much, then you're going to smell like oil. And that's what we don't want. You know, same thing as any product. Just put it all the way through your hair. Get those edges, you know, let those edges grow healthy and beautifully. Act like you got a ponytail, pull it back, pull it up, get that high ponytail like Bonse. Like Bonse. Yep, let's get a little more because I really didn't get the back like that, but. Mm, and we are in there like swim where? Am I right? Am I right, ladies? Okay. Then you get your Jamaican black castor oil, which I've also used on my face. It's good for your face, your hair, your nails, your lips, your eyelids. Use it for everything. The Jamaicans got you, okay? The Jamaicans got you. Go back your hand. I'm not being like super loud because it's a little late. I live in an apartment with my mom, so. I gotta be a little quiet. Not quiet, but not as loud as I normally would be if I'm in the car or talking to friends. Mm, they're all in there. Oh yes, oh yes. I love massaging my hair. Oh, that reminds me. This is also what I do after I wash or co-wash. But yeah, I only do one dip of drinking milk castor oil because I already put 
extra virgin olive oil in my hair, so it's like, what do I need all that oil in my hair for? I just need to be moisturized, not cooked. Okay, so, head, more, uh, head massager that I got at Forever 21. Feels so good. Like, you think just because it's cheap, like, it's not going to feel good? Like, no. It feels good as fuck. Oh. Do you see it just going all the way? Ooh. Ooh. Invest, invest in one, I'm telling you. Your life will change, your hair will grow faster. Oh, okay, I gotta stop, because I will keep going. But yeah. And after you've done all that, get it in there one more time. Wash your hands, because oil on the hands, coronavirus going around, Ebola is still going around. You know, we gotta get rid of that. So, wash your hands. That's what I'm doing right now. Now that you've washed your hands for about 15, 20 seconds, you can put on your bonnet and get to Betty Bye. If it would open. Yes, I have the typical mom bonnet, okay? The typical mom or aunt bonnet or grandma. No, only moms and aunts have this because grandmas don't wear bonnets. Now, when I'm old and my friends are grandmas, they'll probably wear bonnets, but the grandmas now don't wear bonnets. So, we're good. All right, guys, so that is it for today, tonight's to afternoon's video. Um, like, comment, subscribe. I know I said in the last video that I'm not going to really be posting, but I just got bored again. So I made a video, you know? So, like, subscribe, comment, tell me what I should do next want to see my room I guess tell me but yeah also go on iTunes go on Spotify go on SoundCloud search Zamani and listen to my music you won't regret it I am a singer I am a singer now with you not searching you're just missing out which I don't know why you want to miss out like I know you have that FOMO that fear of missing out, you know, that fear of not hearing my voice, that fear of not hearing the beat in the background, that fear of not hearing, um, do you need a little treat, baby? What? Let me give you something sweet, baby. Mm-hmm. So yeah, go ahead and do that. Don't act like you didn't like it. Don't act like you didn't like what I just sang. See ya. Good night.